If you're tuning in right now, you happen to be watching the world's truest source for hip-hop news, black culture, sports, and of course the best reaction videos on the net. I'm talking about Kofi's Universe. If you haven't already subscribed, it's your chance to hit that button now before I hit this blunt. Bada. YouTube salute. Ab Soul has admitted that he was upset with J. Cole after the two artists didn't end up collaborating on his last project, Herbert, that came out in 2022. If you're new to my channel, thumbs up the video. Hit that sub button and click that bell icon to be notified when I upload new content go live. So Abso recently was interviewed by DJ Head and Gina Views on their podcast, Effective, immediately. And he discussed his career and his relationship with J. Cole. Um, we're going to listen to this, y'all. You know, and I'm going to give you Kofi's perspective. Here we go. On there's a song that's a lot of uh, the pie song, right? Yeah. Can you put a timeline on when that was recorded? Because I know Punch, right? Just kind of say like that was recorded a while ago. Yeah, very, Clearly, very, just, yeah, very, very. Give some the context. Oh yeah, let's get to the <laughs> shit, man. Shout out, hey, first of all, shout out my man Cole, man. <laughs> shout out to Cole. What was the fuck Good that? Dude. What was the group dude. chat like? Oh, fuck that. But, uh, <laughs> what was the group chat like Listen. when a nigga dropped seven minute drill, then dropped the project, and then you and Daylight are on it? Listen, nah, nah, Peep what, Gang. What nah. happened? Peep Gang, look, Peep Gang. I'm gonna keep it very. I'm gonna keep it a buck, buck, buck ninety. Listen, he. First of all, I was a little upset with Cole. Not upset, but like. Cole was supposed to be on fuck out my face. For real? Cole, like, I played my... Like, Cole is the homie for it. That's what I want to make very clear to the whole world. Yeah. Cole is really the homie. Like, he... You know, listen, like, and everybody be saying we use... It's always the, been like that, though. Yeah, and everybody be saying we use the... This rappers be using the word friend and homie loosely, like, and, and that's cool, bro. Like, that's what I'm saying. I don't put nothing past no man. Like, we don't, we don't have to be... I pray that, that y'all my real friends, but if not, like, hey, we we yeah. here, like, nigga, yeah. get yours, right? But I'm telling you, like, me and Cole be, been, been concerned about my eyes. Once a nigga be concerned about my eyes and my diet, yeah, that's a good dude. That's yeah. a nice that's guy right dude. there. Yeah. Intentions is pure. That's what I'm saying, yeah. if, you know, and, and if not, all right, like, remember, and he graduated at the top of his class. He, he no dummy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Graduated at the top of his class. He no dummy. He come from cannabis. He, he a real rapper. So... Like, you know, I just needed, like, a 12, like, for the fuck up my face. You know what I'm saying? He picked it. Like, I played him the album. He picked it. So, like, and, like, I, like. He the one that was, like, I'm going to jump on this. Yeah, one. yeah, exactly. Gotcha. And I, like, like bugged him about it. Like, because, I, you know, I was trying to play the game at that point. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, come on, man. I thought you, you know, you feel me? Just a 12. And it just didn't, didn't come to fruition forever. He might not have, he just might not have came, came too. But I did this joint. Me and, me and Light did the joint pie. Yeah. Like, I, I did it for, for Daylight. Um. Daylight's record. It's Daylight's record, yes. and like you know, we just I said like let's uh let's like you know let's collab let's let's do like a back and forth thing. It was just a kind of a sparring se segment, like you know what I'm saying, like between me and him, right? And it's called Pie, literally because when me and Daylight's song stopped ended, it ended on three fourteen, <sighs> like the time, the length Got of you. the song. That's where the title came about. Got you. Just for context, yes. so. I wake up. Some real rapper shit, right? Yeah, now. yeah, right. Yeah, exactly. It was, it was. We was on that. It was yeah, that kind of. You that's feel me? Hard. So, I wake up. I don't know if it's the next morning, but soon after, I wake up one morning like, 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 bro. Check, like, it sent me the sent, sent me uh, the song and, and Cole on there going crazy. I'm like, <laughs> wait, what the? F I'm hot, like, I'm like low key hot. Like, like, I'm like he didn't do the other record, you did this one. <laughs> <clears throat> so, Pete, like, you know, but you know, it, it's uh, you know, uh, sibling rivalry or friend, friend. Yeah. All right, y'all, check out the full interview. Um, DJ Head and Gina views their podcast effective immediately. Check that out. They doing some good stuff over there. So now I didn't know that was actually a daylight track. Daylight featuring um Abso. And now we getting more information that the track originally ended at three minutes and fourteen seconds. Cause you know, Pi, if you're not um uh, familiar with math, geometry, but I love math, one of my favorite subjects, math and science and history. 
But as far as anything, dang, that's interesting. But um, J. Cole jumped on that. He released it on his mixtape that came out earlier this year. And damn, that was that. Um, and a lot of people thought Abso had some type of issue with um J. Cole, but he did it because um Punch cleared up claims about that, about the latest song Squeeze First Two. And then you heard J. Cole came out with his track, Port Antonio. Um talking about how he has nothing against Kendrick and nothing against Drake, yada, yada, yada. But, yeah, I never I never thought Abso had a problem with J. Cole. I never thought that. I mean, you know, people are just going to be saying anything just to, you know, stir the pot, get something going. They want to see people beef. They want to see shit. But like Abso said, that's that's my homie. That's my friend. He really means that. You know, because a lot of people use that word loosely, like he said. And that's true. I don't call everybody my homie. I don't call everybody my homegirl. Because, no, I don't hang with everybody. And I don't even discuss my life with people. Not even people I'm close with sometimes. I keep a lot of things to my heart, to myself. I move like that. You know, if I don't, if I don't tell you really what's really going on in my life, it's F you. And, you know, sometimes you have to just... Let it be and, and, and stay your distance and keep your distance from a lot of people. But it's hard for people to do that. A lot of people need to feed off other people. Um, J. Cole, like I said before, the point, the Port Antonio track, dope track. But I feel like he should have never released that because it's almost like, bro, we already know you apologize at your festival. You said what you had to say, you know. But as far as that, you know, jumping on the track with... Um, so I wish he would have jumped on that track, F-O-M-F. You know what I'm saying? F out my face. Well, that would have been dope as hell. That's a dope ass beat right there, too. But who knows? There always there's always a chance that J. Cole and Abso could do another collab track. Anything is, you know, anything can happen in the future. Hopefully, hip hop fans can get that. Post your comments below. Hoax Smash, Black Panther, the like button, subscribe to my channel. Click the bell icon to be notified when I upload new content and go live. You want to support, donate to the channel. I have Patreon, patreon.com slash Kofi Universe. Venmo, Cash App, PayPal, Streamlabs, everything's in the description. Until next time, salute.